Hey team, what's cooking? Vin Lamanti here. I want to go over the daily method of operation. Your daily disciplines done daily will build character in your business. A lot of times we have goals and dreams. In fact, we have to have goals and dreams in order to get pulled through the process and develop true wealth, true freedom, and create the type of business and empire you're looking to create. But with that, a lot of times we get kind of uh, hung up on what is it that I really have to do. A lot of times we have these very big goals, big dreams. What happens is we become overwhelmed, with, which then leads to procrastination. So I have a daily method of operation that we have on the website that I want to go over right now that will help you stay focused, stay on track, and keep you uh, in line with your goals and dreams. Remember, the, the uh, journey of a thousand miles begins with the first step. And it's, a, it's a, a lot of little steps that lead to the big uh, goals and dreams and to the destination. You know, if you have a destination but you don't have directions, it's kind of difficult to get there. So these are the directions on how to get there. If you, when you go on the uh, GrowV.com website, go to GrowV.com and you go, go to training. And when you, when you uh, scroll down, you'll see a PDF that says uh, DMO, which stands for Daily Method of Operation. And it says Lead and Build. Now, I want to go into that right now. You want to print that out. And you want to have that out. And you want, I want to go over that right now. Now, these are absolutely things that anyone can do. So you can do it. The question is, will you do it? So, you know, I want to go over it and how to use this sheet and how this can create just tremendous wealth, too. Because what happens is I'm going to go over this without even, even getting into the principle of leverage. Once you have a leverage in your organization, you have people that are following you because you're, you're doing these income producing activities, the activities that build an organization, you'll then have two people doing it, four people doing it, eight people doing it, 30 people doing it, 60 people doing the same activities in your organization. These results that produce income. We often talk about the three P's. I go into videos and, and a lot of trainings on the three P's. What are the three P's? The production, the payout, and the, pr and the promotion. So we want to get into the production and stay in the production. The payout will follow and the promotions will follow that. So the promotions being the pin levels. But the, the production is this. Now let's go over this. Hopefully you printed it out. If not, you can pause the video and then come back and then we'll, uh, we'll go over it. Look, you're back. Good. So uh, with this, you have the daily method of operation. And you'll see here we have boxes throughout. Okay, these these uh, come out to 31 boxes. If it's a you know 30 day month, it's up to you know 31 days in a month. So on a daily basis, the reason we do this is we, we want to create the mindset, skill set, and the habits that will produce the results you're looking to to attain. So the first thing we want to do is add to your list. On a daily basis, we're always adding to our list. I like to keep a pen and pad near my bed. At night, because a lot of times your wheels are spinning at night and you're thinking of people. When people come into your mind, there's a reason they're coming to you. All right, the, the, There's a reason these names are being given to you. All right, uh, So you want to take those names and write them down, then add to your list. So on a daily basis, you want to add to your list. Anyone can do that. Can you do it? I don't know. Will you do it? We'll see. Can you do it? Yes. Will you do it? We will see. The next thing you want to do is make five prospecting calls a day. It's not a lot to do, uh, particularly if you're looking to create wealth. If, if it's something, look, if you, if you need to do two, you do two. If you want to do ten, you do ten. But making five prospecting calls, now these, are, these are calls that, uh, you know, you will get voicemails, you will get other, other things. And again, plug into uh, webinars and trainings that we have on the site regarding how to invite, what to say, how to say, it, why not to, why to say it, why not to say certain things. But make those five prospecting calls a day. Will you do it? Set up one appointment. How do you set up appointment? Again, go through the training on the training page on how to set up an appointment. But you want to set up one appointment a day. Could be a Starbucks appointment. Could it be a home meeting appointment. Could be a meeting for someone to come to a meeting. It could be an online meeting. Okay. So set up one appointment per day. These things compound over time. Connect with five team members. If you're new in the business, connect with your upline. Connect with the people in the team. Listen to the calls. But when you have an organization, connect with five team members. As your team grows, you'll be able to um, you know, articulate and, and determine who are the key leaders in your organization. And also, who do you tap root? Who do you welcome to your team? Who do you welcome into the organization? Who are you, plugging, who are you locking arms with to help them you know, get, uh, get the production, the, um, the payout, and the promotion that, that month? Who do you want to help go to director that particular month? All right? Uh, <clears throat> excuse me. 
Read, listen, and participate. Read or listen to an audio at least 15 minutes a day. If you do the math, 15 minutes per day, anyone can do that. You know, we have uh, a lot of, we want to use our time wisely and uh, we'll do it in the car. A lot of times you'll, you'll end up doing an hour a day, two hours a day if you have a commute. Turn your car into a rolling university. Use your time wisely. It's key important for your personal development to read or listen to an audio, uh, a suggested audio for 15 minutes per day. Family time. This is key. I'm going to give you an example. Uh, last night, my kids were wilding again in the house. They're wilding. They're going crazy and they're running around. And they were like puppies fighting, kind of hurting one another a little bit, but playing and back and forth. You know, if you're a parent, you know, they drive you insane. So with that, I said, you know what? I took off my sneakers. Instead of yelling like I sometimes do and stop it, blah, blah. I says, and I jumped right in the mix. And I started playing with them. I think it was about seven to ten minutes, probably about eight minutes that I played with them, and they had the time of their life. I had the time of my life. The family spells love, T-I-M-E. Remember that. So family time is is really important for balance. This is about the, this is the on the balance portion. Okay, exercising. When you exercise, listen. If you if you're heavily into training, you can do an hour a day, an hour and a half a day. If not, you're new into whatever. Do a minute a day. Do one push up. And we can get into that about compounding. We're gonna do compounding goals. How that can add up. You're gonna be feel much better about yourself once you uh, start exercising a little bit. Corey Everson says, you "Gotta sweat." So do a little something to to, to sweat. And also, the next thing is review your goals and dreams. Review these things. Go over these things. It's important to do that to manifest your goals and dreams. And, you know, when you see those goals and dreams and have those lofty goals and dreams like we said, like I spoke about in the beginning of the video, your activities will pull you through that process. So, again, reviewing your goals and dreams, you want to have that so you can remind yourself, what is it that I'm looking to accomplish? Why do I want to accomplish this? What are my goals and dreams? Review these things daily, okay? Underneath it also has, um, I'm committed to show X amount of plans this month. I am reading such and such book. I'm committed to attending X amount of, event, uh, of events this month. The reason why I'm committing to these goals is such and such. Now, this is also for an accountability partner. And it's also you, your accountability can be yourself. Write these things down. Have it some way where you can see it. And check these boxes off each day when you complete each one, okay? Be honest with yourself. Be honest with your business as you go through. If you just do these, these activities here, it'll absolutely completely change the complexion of your business and your life. So... Onward and upward, I will absolutely see you guys at the top.